Crikey O'Reilly, hello and welcome to Anderson's TV. I'm on my own in a room. I'm your resident Rumpelstiltskin with a dodgy beard. And I'm here to take you through these, this battle of the Titans, the 73 note Titans, the Yamaha CP73, come on, versus the Korg SV2, brand new on the block, 73 keys, versus the Nord Electro 6D73 keys. We're gonna look at piano sounds, Roads, then we're going to do claps, then we're going to do whirlies, and then we'll do organs. And at the end of it, you might know a bit more about it. Let's do it. <coughs> Piano first. Each of the keyboards are set to their initial first patch. Each one's a piano. We've got other videos on the channel where we go through these individually. For the sake of speed and sanity today, we're just going to keep to some like core presets see what they're offering. Now, give them the best shot. This is what they turn on with. This is the Nord Electro first in the key of D. Similar thing on the Korg. onto the Yamaha. I'm walking in the air. Just a little bit exactly the same on each so you can hear. Close enough. What do you think? I'm going to tell you what I think about the feel of them because you can't experience that. You may be able to decide the sound for yourself. Three big differences here. This Nord Electro, I've got the waterfall key bed. Love it, and it might come into its own when we get to the electric pianos and the organ, uh, but can't deny that the best feeling out, for, out of these three for me was the Yamaha. Just feels really posh. Uh, anyway, that's my opinion on that. Let's move on to Rhodesville. On to Rhodes sounds. Again, not gonna go into an exhaustive search with these things. What I have done, instead of just the initial patch, I've made sure I've got no reverb on these things and no effects just so you can hear the raw sample and I've chosen uh, on this one I'm using the EP8 Nefertiti XL this one I'm using the third variation on EP1 and that one is the first Rhodes variation and they kind of had a similar timbre uh, and I'm going to play something to the Korg. Yamaha. Let's 
let's get stabbed, dig into it a bit. Interesting, should we put a little bit of trim on there? Just to hear what the effects are like. I'm gonna do no amp modeling, uh, a little bit of trim. A little bit of trim on here, let's see if we can find it. Let's see if we can find it, yeah. Modulation, <laughs> chorus, tremolo, on. Let's have a look, turn it on, on, trim. Hopefully a little insight into what it sounds like with a rose patch. Obviously you go to town with some of the effects. Let's get on to, what did I say I was gonna do? Clavinets. Clavinets now, I have no reverb on all of these sounds and no effects, it's gonna be pretty dry and boring, but interesting, I just dialed up, uh, there's a couple of variations here on the Korg, on the Nord you have the choice of all the pickups and there's a couple choices on the CP. Let's hear it, uh, something like this. Okay, you Korg. Hopefully without flopping up this time. Over to the Yamaha. That's cool. I think it's like slung it down an octave by normal standards, which is something I do anyway. Anyway, let's put, uh, I'm gonna be right back in a minute, I'm gonna put these all to an amp simulator with some auto wah and a bit of reverb and see what the difference makes. Let's do it. All right, we've got the Nord going first here again. Let's hear the clavinet going through the auto wah into a Fender Twin halfway on the drive with a bit of stage reverb as well. Cork. to the Yamaha. Interesting, obviously very different ideas on clav sounds and drive sounds, really big differences there. I could get them close, 
but that's just going like half mast on the controls on those things. Bit on the touch as well. Hey, it feels great on here with the light keys, but these keyboards, you could hear it. There was a lot of speed in there, so no worries there. Let's go on to Wurlitzers. Wurlitzers, taking all the reverbs off. No trim to start with. This is the Wurlitzer 2 model in the Nord Electro that I like. So weird playing like this. Right, let's put a bit of trim on. Really dynamic on the Yamaha. Interesting stuff. Into the final test organ. Final round of this versus match between the 73 note keyboards. Into the organ round. Gonna start with the Nord. How do I demo this when these guys are quite clearly, you know, bringing a lemon to a knife fight? Uh, we're gonna have just three draw bars out on the bottom here. I've got percussion on a third. What I'm gonna do is play similar chords on each. I'm gonna turn, on these two, I can turn the rotary speed on and off, so I'll let you hear that. And then I'll probably crank the drive. No, I won't do anything with drive. We did that on the clavinet. Let's do it. Uh... Is a joy on that keyboard. Onto the Yamaha. So it's got a bit of reverb on it. hope that gave you an idea of what the core gubbins like to call them of each keyboard sounds like my little thoughts on it are instantly is that if you're an organ player there's only one place to go if you do a lot of organ the sb2 looks gorgeous 
uh, that re so if I was a artist and thinking about how it looked performing on stage, I'd probably go, go for that. It's got really the heaviest action out of the three as well. So if you like a heavier action, that's for you. And a really nice bold piano sound. Didn't go into a, it's got a really good other sounds as well, pads. Anyway, and then the Yamaha was really good. And the action feels really posh. It feels like a jump up for me. Uh, I like, and I think it covers the ground of all the keyboards the best. It's the best in between. Not as heavy as this, but then it felt very refined. And we've got a pitch bed of mod wheel, pitch bend and mod wheel up there, which we didn't get into because that can do uh, widdly woo sounds and things like that. Anyway, I digress. Hope that helped. Let me know in the comments if this is any use or in the coming weeks, I'm in here, on, in here on my own. It's different doing the videos. So any ideas of stuff I could do on my own other than <clears throat> would be great. I'm going to play you out with something like this. Back to the initial patches.